Hi, my name is Maya Darmé and I play the harp. And I'm Mohamed Amin Qarai, I'm a canon player, uh, which is a string instrument from the Middle East and North Africa. Uh, it's a zither, uh, a cousin of the harp, and I play it on my lap. Together we created the band Harkan two years ago. Um, the band was born in Tunisia with the objective of playing music from all around the greater Mediterranean region. Um, we didn't want to set any stylistic boundaries, so we decided that we would play both traditional melodies from many centuries ago that we found through our research, and more recent works by living composers from the area, whether it be jazz or contemporary music. Um, we will be performing at Leighton House next year, and we are very excited about it. Um, in the meantime, though, we wanted to leave you with a little video that we recorded uh, before being stuck in two different countries. Um, the piece that we're playing is a sirto. It's a traditional folk dance from Greece and Western Turkey. This particular sirto is called Sultani Yega Sirto. It's uh, a well-known melody, one of the classics of Turkish music. It's divided into uh, two main sections. It starts with a slow 5-4 rhythm, uh, section which turn in the fast dance uh, in the second section. It was very popular in the 19th century Ottoman Empire and it would definitely have been a staple at any social gatherings or even at the Sultan's courts at the time Leighton visited the area. Uh, this form of music would have been played by small uh, chamber music ensemble including mostly canoe player which was and still a very popular instrument at the time. Um, over the years though, sirtos became a genre of art music that wasn't necessarily meant to accompany dancers anymore. Um, they remain to this day really um, one of the main music forms in Turkish classical music, much like we would say, for instance, a sonata in, in Western classical music. Um, they are often played towards the end of a performance, as a grand finale, if you wish. Uh, this is the kanun I play in the video. Uh, it was made in Izmir, Turkey, and it's a Turkish kanun. It's different from the Arabic kanun, uh, mainly by the dimensions and the numbers of levers for uh, each course of strings, thus allowing uh, the possibility to play micro intervals uh, specific to Ottoman and also Tunisian music as well as a brighter sound.